We start with breaking news just into our newsroom. Honolulu police say two men have been arrested in connection to last night's shooting in Kaka'ako that killed a 39-year-old man. HPD says a 26-year-old and a 19-year-old are in custody. Charges are pending. Police say it started as an argument. They say the first suspect shot the victim multiple times. HPD says the victim's friend attempted to intervene and the first suspect tried to fire his weapon, but the firearm did not not discharge. That's when the second suspect grabbed the firearm and tried to shoot the victim's friend. Nikki Shenfield reports. HPD says just before midnight, an argument broke out near Kaka'ako Waterfront Park. Gunshots were heard and multiple vehicles were seen leaving the area. It was discovered that a 39-year-old male victim sustained multiple gunshot wounds. Police say he later died at the hospital. The suspect is described as a Polynesian male with long black curly hair, wearing a black t-shirt and jeans. Reportedly, the suspect fled in a dark colored truck. Police say it appears the victim and suspect knew each other. Broken bottles and chairs remained at the scene this morning as families went to the beach and did other activities. As we're walking by, my friend said, oh, it looks like had a party here last night, but maybe not so fun party. Many residents say they are concerned as HPD is still investigating six attempted murders this week alone. One happened around 9.45 last night in Waikiki. Police say a 21-year-old was walking to his car when four men demanded his property. HPD says the victim refused and was stabbed multiple times. Police say the suspects are unknown and the victim is in serious but stable condition. Overall, crime in Hawaii is down for the last almost 30 years. Crime in the 90s was about twice what it is now. State data shows that there were 313 murders from 1990 to 1999, 182 in the early 2000s, and 190 up to 2019. There isn't data yet from the last three years, but Honolulu is at 18 homicides so far this year. Over the decades, firearms were used in less than half of these murders, followed by physical fighting and objects like knives. We really have a strict uh, you know, gun law, but what that means is if people misuse and use guns in crimes, we will prosecute you, and that's a separate offense. You know, using a, a, a firearm in the commission of a felony and you get charged then you will be going to prison. If you have any information on the shooting or stabbing overnight, call 911 or Crime Stoppers. Nikki Schoenfeld, KJ2 News, working for Hawaii.